The future of wearables is here with the highly anticipated Apple Glasses. These augmented reality glasses will give you the ability to interact with digital information and objects in a whole new way, right through transparent lenses. Apple Glasses will eliminate the need to look at your phone for messages and maps, as AR technology will superimpose them onto the real world. With transparent lenses, you'll also be able to see AR ads and digital art throughout the city, providing a unique experience exclusive to the glasses. Recently, we've received information that the highly anticipated Apple Glasses are slated for a launch in January 2025. For those unfamiliar, the Apple Glasses are innovative augmented reality glasses that merges the functionality of glasses with cutting-edge technology. They are an augmented reality device, meaning they will overlay digital information on the physical world in real time, providing a unique and immersive experience. Apple aims to develop AR glasses that strike a balance between comfort and functionality. The glasses must be lightweight and thin, allowing for extended wear without discomfort. At the same time, they must be equipped with enough power to support AR technology and provide a minimum battery life of at least four hours. Designing and producing AR glasses that meet all these specifications is a challenging task and is one of the reasons why it has taken Apple several years to develop such a product. The compact size of the glasses means that there is limited space for the necessary components, such as cameras, sensors, and a battery to power the AR technology. Additionally, the AR technology itself requires a significant amount of power, which can further strain the battery and limit its life. Furthermore, ensuring a lightweight and comfortable design while still accommodating the necessary components is a difficult balancing act that requires careful consideration of materials and manufacturing processes. The demand for high-quality optics and display technology also presents a challenge, as these components must be small enough to fit within the form factor of the glasses, while still providing clear and accurate images, without the glasses overheating or creating any sort of noise to ensure maximum comfort. All of these factors make it difficult to design and produce Apple glasses that meet the desired specifications and provide the desired user experience, which is why it has taken Apple several years to develop such a product. The good news is that the wait for the highly anticipated Apple glasses is almost over. As we approach the official launch, we're eager to share all the latest information, including the specs, release date, and price of this innovative augmented reality device that promises to revolutionize the way we interact with technology. There are similar companies out there making similar AR glasses like Ray-Ban and Unreal, but the Apple glasses are poised to set the bar for AR technology with its sleek design, intuitive user interface, and seamless integration with other Apple devices. So let's start exploring what we know so far about Apple glasses. We have heard some leaks and rumors come up since 2015, but it wasn't until 2019 that Apple actually started pushing on AR in their keynotes and demos, since the introduction of the LiDAR sensor on both the iPhone and iPad Pro. It is said that Apple desires to create a stylish and friendly appearance for their Apple Glass. Apple Watch is a good place to look for how Apple handles wearable design subtle, but still obviously a piece of tech. There have been a few patents issued by Apple regarding the design and functionality of AR glasses, like tunable and fovated lens systems, which is a new system of lenses that adjust to match the user's prescription. It describes a clever system of lenses that can be manipulated to act as a regular pair of glasses. The difference is that the system adjusts the position of the lenses automatically, and any person with or without prescription lenses could use it without any problems. Here is another one that shows the idea of swappable temples. Despite this patent illustration appearing like safety glasses, the final product may resemble a typical pair of glasses, as this is a prototype drawing meant to illustrate the patent and not the product. 
Creating a wearable tech product that appeals to consumers is challenging. The style, color, and lens shape can greatly impact purchasing decisions, and Apple is known for its one-size-fits-all approach for many of its products. Additionally, Apple has been rumored to be working on a Heritage Edition set of glasses, designed to look like the ones worn by Steve Jobs, which could be sold at a premium. The Apple glasses will come equipped with lenses that have built-in displays that can be interacted with using gestures. According to Mac Rumors, Apple is planning to use Sony's micro OLED displays that feature an ultra-fast response rate, ultra-high contrast, a wide color gamut, high luminance, low reflectance, and integrated drivers for a thin, light design. According to John Prosser, the Apple glasses may have a similar look to Ray-Ban Wayfarers or Tim Cook's glasses. However, a report by Bloomberg claiming a prototype resembles high-end sunglasses with thick frames housing the battery and microchips may not be accurate, as the addition of chips would likely result in a bulky design, requiring cooling, defeating the purpose of sleek glasses. Instead, Apple analyst Ming-Chi Kuo predicts Apple Glasses will be positioned as an accessory to the iPhone, functioning as a connected display while relying on the iPhone for all the heavy computing, networking, and positioning tasks. The Apple Glasses are likely to cost around $499, with prescription lenses offered at an extra cost. Additionally, privacy concerns make it doubtful that Apple Glasses will have an integrated camera. The built-in camera on Google Glass, which sparked controversy due to the potential for a secret recording, resulted in bans on wearing the device in public spaces like casinos and theaters. To avoid similar issues, Apple will be using LiDAR sensors that deliver a new type of depth sensing allowing for AR experiences. Mark Gurman from Bloomberg reports that development of the Apple Glass has been delayed due to technical challenges. Apple has faced difficulties in creating a lightweight wearable with the power of an iPhone and sufficient battery life. Although progress has slowed, the project has not been entirely discontinued as there have been numerous eye injury reports that show that Apple is still working on these AR glasses. Two individuals suffered eye injuries while testing prototypes, where one person needed medical treatment beyond basic first aid after experiencing eye discomfort while using a prototype. In another report, an employee reported eye pain after working with a new prototype and suspected a connection to its use. All this shows that Apple is still early in the development of this product, and with work on Apple Glasses experiencing some delays, there is no word on when Apple might be ready to launch the product. But my guess is that Apple will launch these glasses two to three years after the launch of the first generation mixed reality headsets, which are set to launch this year and set to revolutionize the mixed reality industry. Watch this video next to find out more about Apple's mixed reality headsets. And let me know, would you consider buying these Apple glasses for $500?